Hey guys, Danielle here, and today I am doing my March favorites for you guys. Um, I don't really have a lot, but what I do have is um, pretty cool stuff. <laughs> um, so yeah, so as always, I'm going to start with makeup. At least I think I always start with makeup. I don't know. It's been like a kind of a hectic day, and it's like 9.30 right now, so I'm kind of like really tired. So I will try to get through this video as fast as possible and without making a complete fool of myself. So, let's begin. Okay, so as I said, we are going to start with beauty products, and the first beauty, bleh, the first beauty products that I have are actually two products. They are the NYX Matte Bronzer and the NYX uh, Illuminator. And... <sighs> my dog is barking. And these are like really nice. They're like really kind of, um, it's like a bronzer and then a highlighter. And I've been using these for a while. I don't have them on my face. Oh my god, this one broke. Ugh. Like legit, it just broke, but I can probably salvage it or something. Um, but yeah, it's like really good. And it works really well. And it doesn't uh, make your face too shiny and it contours really nice so yeah and here are the containers that they come in because I saved the containers and so yeah so I love these they are really nice they're working absolutely great so highly recommend them so the next product that I have for my monthly favorites is this uh, Pixi Flawless Beauty Primer. I absolutely love this primer. I got it in my March Ipsy bag and I have been loving it ever since. It is really nice and it just makes your makeup like kind of easy to wash off at night and it, it sets a nice uh, foundation for your foundation. <laughs> so this is definitely awesome. The next product kind of goes hand in hand with that, and it is my, uh, the Porefessionals Benefit, uh, primer, I guess. And I've heard a lot of stuff about this, and I had to try it, and it is absolutely amazing. It makes your pores disappear. Now, I have really bad pores, so it doesn't cover them fully, but you can definitely tell where you have, like, minimal pores, where this is definitely going to help you out a lot, and it'll make your pores disappear. For the most part, it makes my pores disappear, except for the few really big pores that I have, and so, I mean, you know, it's, it's really nice. It's a good product. This, I think, was $31 uh, at Sephora, and so yeah, so I really like it, and the packaging is too cute, so yeah, so this is one of my favorites, I absolutely love it, and I would highly recommend it to anyone that has issues with pores on their face, so yeah. Alright, so the last um, beauty product that I have in my favorites videos is my Naked three palette. I am absolutely in love with this palette so much. I've like been using it so much and it's like really bad. I need to stop using it. But um, this was $52 at Sephora and it just has the rosiest colors and the it's neutrals and it's so pretty and I absolutely love it. And I have it on right now except I've been through an entire day but yet it still kind of looks pigmented. Um, so yeah, so I really like this. It's a really nice eyeshadow palette. Um, definitely would recommend this to anyone. So yeah, definitely. Alright, so now I'm going to go into uh, a little bit of nail care. And I actually had to cut down on my nails because they were just getting a little bit too long. So they are all short right now. But what helped me get them so long is this Sally Henson nail growth miracle it's still in the container because I had to get a new bottle um I swear by this stuff it absolutely works it is kinda creepy how much it works um so yeah so it is the growth treatment nail growth miracle up to 30 percent longer nails in five days and yeah they mean it um results guaranteed salon strength sal salon 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 
Why do I think I'm saying that wrong? Salon Strength Formula supports fast natural na nail growth. It is really amazing. It is kind of like a base coat. Um, and there's all these, you know, what it is, description, how it works, action, the results, uh, to use, apply one thing, coat of bare nails every other day, or as a base coat, I swear by this stuff, it makes your nails grow so fast, and again, my nails are really short right now because I had to cut them back, but I'm going to start using this again, and hopefully in a few days you guys will definitely see a difference, and I would highly recommend this to anyone. Um, who is trying to grow out their nails or have a, have uh, trouble growing their nails out because my nails will not grow by themselves. Uh, so yeah, so I love this. And this was like I think 8 or $9 at uh, Rite Aid. So yeah, and you can find it like at CVS and like Walmart and Target, like anywhere where they sell uh, Sally Hansen nail polish. But I would highly recommend this to you guys. Alright guys, so the next topic is going to be music. I really only have one song for this month, and I am so in love with it, and it just came out like last week, so I guess it's not the full month, but whatever. And it is Joey Graceffa's Silver Lining, uh, the song there. I'll put a link to it below so you can get it on iTunes, and I'll put the link to the video uh, below as well so you guys can check that out. Um, I absolutely love it. If you haven't read it, or <laughs> if you haven't read it, if you haven't watched it already or listened to it already, definitely go check it out. It's kind of, I mean, it's a really short song, but it's definitely a happy-go-lucky song, and, you know, it just puts you in a great mood. Um, it's definitely going to be the song that, like, I drive to school with, uh, in the mornings, and it just puts me in a good mood for the rest of the, uh, for the rest of the day, and I really enjoy that. Um, it's a great song, and it's just... Good job, Joey. I applaud you. Okay, so the last topic that I have for you guys is video games. Um, it's kind of a weird topic, but I recently, uh, my dad got a Xbox One, and he got a PlayStation 4, but I've been obsessed with the Xbox, Xbox One, and through the month of March, I've already finished a game and started another one. Now, I'm really not, like, a gamer gamer. I'm not into, like, Call of Duty, Call of Duty and Halo. Um, I don't like a lot of combat video games. So, I found these two games that are... You're a very loud truck. Um, I found these two video games that are really cool. One is... Tomb Raider, the Definitive Edition. I actually loved playing this game. I'm finished with it. Um, I still have to do some quests here and there, but it is so amazing. Um, it's scary how lifelike it is. You know, you get stranded on this island and there's something going on and there's storms coming and it's you're looking for, uh, you know, Hirokai or Hiroki. Um, and it is absolutely amazing, and it is so thrilling, and it's just, it's a nice video, it's a nice video game, you know, you can, the thing that I don't like is the combat in the video games, and it's a really nice game that, you know, you can, you know, hide behind something and shoot someone from across, and it's all about timing it right so that the other people don't see, um, and it's really fun, and it's a really cool game. The next game that I've started and I am kind of obsessed with is Thief, and uh, I just got this game, and it is really fun. You can play through the whole game without killing a single person, which I really like, even though I've already failed at that. Um, but yeah, it's really fun. You kind of sneak around and steal things and you're trying to not get caught and it's really awesome and I really like it um so yeah so that is this is my new favorite game at the moment so yeah so I definitely would recommend these two games ah, to anyone who doesn't like the combat of Call of Duty but likes video games and likes sneaking around and kind of puzzle solving those kind of gamers I definitely suggest these two games they are completely awesome and totally amazing and I love them uh, the only thing with Thief is 
that usually I like to be able to see my character when I walk around and Thief it shows you the character's viewpoint like you can't see the character it's like if you were looking and you were in the game um, so that's the only thing that I don't really like is uh, playing video games like that kind of makes me a little bit nauseous um, so I've been having to play this in little spurts of like five or ten minutes um, but you can actually get a lot done in this game in five or ten minutes it just depends on how quiet you are and how stealth-like you are. So, yeah, definitely recommend these two games. So, I think that is it for my March favorites. There really wasn't a lot that went on in March. Um, so, yeah, so I love you guys so much. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Uh, tell me what your favorite things were in March. If you have one of these products or if you played this game or heard this song you know please let me know and uh, please give me your uh, reaction to it and so yeah so leave a comment below like this video don't forget to subscribe for videos every other day hopefully as soon as I can figure out my camera ordeal um so yeah so Oh, um, please follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Um, Facebook and Instagram is Mega Diva Danielle, and on Twitter I am Mega Diva Rose. So definitely check those out and follow and subscribe. Um, so yeah, so I think that's it for you guys. I love you all so much, and I will see you next time. Stay so beautiful. Mwah. take our two shades here I'm using this light purple color and this kind of teal color and we're going to put uh, two little lines on a triangular sponge and then we are going to dab it onto our nails and this is how you get the ombre 